Hi, everybody. Welcome to Toronto, Ontario. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski. People have been buzzing around this arena all afternoon. Here we are, finally ready to drop the puck. Playoff games are different from the moment you wake up in the morning till the final horn goes off. So much fun. We are about set to some pushing and shoving here, heating up. Yeah, the few words lead to a little bit more, it looks like. The quest for look, and they're gonna go. Now, early in the game, it looks like they're trying to get the jump at each other here. And the crowd on their feet. They wanted it. They got it. And we might even see more. Yeah, in the rivalry game where you don't like the other team, it doesn't take much to spark a fight. As always, the guys are up banging their sticks on the board. A little more energy from the visiting team as their guy won the decision. You can see the shoulders just hanging a little bit lower here on the bench. Marner's won the draw. Takes it across the blue line. Puts it up front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. A chance in front. Here's a backhand. Takes the feed. Hammers the shot. Can't get it to go. Handles the puck. And a great heads up defensive play here. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. Underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. No, oh, denies it with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Big stop by the keeper. Passes the puck over to Skinner. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Makes the save. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. Takes a shot and the puck skips off the glove. Right out front. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Here's a shot! Denies him on the play! Quick pass to Ruido. Moves the puck to Skinner. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Snaps one from the slot! Stones him with the blocker! Referee signaling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. Bobrovsky's getting called for two minutes here by the officials. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the plate. You're a step behind. You've got to slow that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe you can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch up and got burned. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. And if you're one of these power play guys, James, you can't wait now. It's your first opportunity of the night. You get out on the power play. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Datsuk's getting two for boarding here. I like the call here, James, because the, the hit had too much force behind it, and it looked like it was a long run. No argument on this one either. Big opportunity here for them. They'll have plenty of time to work this five-on-three. With such a long five-on-three power play in front of them, they can... He scores! Well, they've been hoping that the extra work they've done on the power play would help them capitalize. They do a nice job there. This makes the coaches look smart every time. They depend on him for offense, and he delivers James time and time again. Buffalo's got the opening goal in this contest. So much time left, but it just feels better to play with the lead, and they must be pretty happy to score that quickly. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Misses wide. Not really close with that. He got 
got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. Moves it to Ristolainen. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Interference is the call here, Ray. If he moves his feet just a little bit more, he's in better position. And with that call, it's a five-on-three power play set to go. That's quite some time on the five-on-three. What a big advantage for them. They have to take advantage of this opportunity. You can't let a two-man advantage slip away. Just slide to the net. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Right in the slot. Wow. He scores! Hard to get him much quicker than that. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Quick feed to Ristolainen. Here's a rocket of a shot. Puts it wide. I know he's looking for the perfect shot. He's going to be disappointed that he didn't get it on the cage. Buffalo's got control of the puck. Puck picked up by Subban. Gets it out of his own end. Oh, smart heads up, Reed. Takes a shot, and he makes the save. Takes the pass from his goaltender. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Oh, what a chance. Oh, James, he tried to get rid of that in a hurry. He just misses. Great hand-eye contact on the play. Ristolainen's got it on the offensive end. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Grabbed along the boards by Darlene. Taken by Wheeler. Quick feed down low. And he slides it quickly to Eichel. Buffalo's got a hold of it against the wall. Scooped up along the wall by Smith. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Buffalo's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. It's still in the zone and taken by a teammate. Unleashes a cannon! Just wide! Picked up along the wall by Zadorov. And that one's broken up! Van Riemsdyk's carrying it ahead. Centering pass! Nice pass. Wilson's out of the box. Hey, I think I killed two penalties in my life. Looked to me like the penalty killers did a good job there. They didn't really give up anything. That was a good-looking chance, but he turned it away. Still lots of time left here in this frame. 2-0 is the score. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. And manages to clear the zone. The Sabres scoop it up along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. And there's the save. And now he moves it quickly to Primo. Takes that pass back at the point. Denies him on the slapper. Into the corner of the attacking area. Moves it quickly over to Ovechkin. Oh, and comes up with a stop. Feeds it to Yokiharu. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. The focus of the other team is going to be on him. He's one of the league leaders in points, and they've got to find a way to shut him down. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played, and it's a comfortable 2-0 lead we're looking at right now. Buffalo's looking to break out of their own end. Through center along the wing. Sends the pass over. Wrist shot from the slot. Whoa. Scores! Blake Wheeler. Ha! Huh. Better to be lucky than good. This thing bounces around and somehow evades the goaltender. I don't even really know how that ended up in the net. Buffalo's taken full advantage of their scoring opportunities with a comfortable lead here in the first. Puck is dropped and play resumes. 
Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the puck, and he gets a stick caught in their feet. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. Buffalo's got the puck along the wall. Eichel's going to play it against the half wall. Puck scooped up by McKenzie. Gets it out of his own end. Dished on over to Reinhardt. And now it's grabbed by Smith. Looking to break out here on the power play. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Toronto's got possession while undermanned. Traps that puck tight into his chest. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Temper's flaring, and he's going to pay for that roughing the call, Ray. You rarely get a roughing penalty unless you're warned first to stop. He had to pull the plug. And manages to clear the zone. Puck grabbed by Darlene. Handles the bank pass from along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. Moves the puck. Knocked away. Tees it up from the blue line. Big save. Buffalo's been the better team here in this first period, and as a result, they've got a big lead. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Clearing attempt, and he moves the puck across the blue line out of the defensive zone. Toronto's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Gets it out of his own end. The Sabres gain possession along the wall. Wholesale changes made here as they reset on the power play. Keeps hold of the puck. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Buffalo's gained possession. Pokes the puck away. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. I know he doesn't like the call on this one. Nobody does, but I think he has a case here, Ray. Well, it looked like the penalty was going to be called, and then it got sold even more so. So that's a hooking call that he doesn't really like. Time certainly on the penalty killing unit here. A little four-on-three action. I would say the four-on-three is more of a shooting power play. Now that they've taken that... He might have a step here. He's in. All alone. Buries it for the goal. Once he pulls away from everybody here, it's him and the goaltender. He freezes him, goes to the backhand, and puts it away. Buffalo's offense has been on fire to start this one, and still lots of time left in the first. Kerfoot's one possession. Puck picked up by McDavid. Blocker save! A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Hammers a shot, standing tall with the save. Yeah, he got a little testy once the whistle blown. He's pushing him out of there. I get what he's thinking. Lots of times you don't want to fight the guy that's staring you down. Buffalo's taken full advantage of their scoring opportunities with a comfortable lead here in the first. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. is your one-stop shot for you can get new styles of jerseys, shirts, hats, and more in our team store. Buffalo's been the better team here in this first period, and as a result, they've got a big lead. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Here's a short pass to Ovechkin. Protects the puck around all sorts of danger. Handles the pass from the right wing. Excellent stick work on the play. Taken by Yokiharu. Move to the middle, and that's broken up. Oh, and they forced the turnover. This could turn into something. Quick pass to Kulak. 
looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And as he steps back out onto the ice, they'll go to work with the man advantage here. Looks to set up at the point now. And they'll dump it in. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Now over to Primo. Primo's going to play the puck behind the cage. Puck scooped up by Kulak. Toronto's got control of it now here in the offensive end. And manages to clear the zone. Last call here on this man advantage. Yeah, the power play's got to get the puck up the ice with a little bit of urgency. Takes the feed from the left side. That's a great heads-up play to break up the pass. Hey, buddy, you got the lead. Play safe. Slides the puck over. Oh, he's going to be shaking his head after that one. Yeah, you go back to the bench here, kicking yourself in the rear end. You've got a scoring chance, and you don't even get it on net. Still to come in period number two. Lots of action on the ice. And up in the broadcast booth, business will pick up. The iconic Snoop Dogg will join us here. Here in the later stages of this period, this has been a lopsided affair. 4 nothing is where we're sitting. He scores! Now the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely, and they're able to capitalize on the extra man. Get to the net. That's where the goals are. The rebound sits there, and he puts it away. In the final moments of this period, Buffalo's turned this into a blowout, now leading by four. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Scored by number 23. Over the line they come. Puck dumped in. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Long lead pass up the center. Gets in front of it. Marner's such a good goal scorer. It's no surprise that he's among the league leaders in this playoff season in goals. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Sends it over to Yoki Haru. Hey, we got a legitimate rock star who's going to be dropping by the broadcast booth coming up in period number two. So don't go anywhere. Fans tonight are really There are legends, and then there are, what, immortals. And this guy joins us in the broadcast booth at this time. Here he is, the one, the only Snoop Dogg. Man, it is a pleasure, sir. Hey, man, look here, James. The pleasure's all mine. What a night. What a night for some good hockey, baby. What a party we've got now. You always seem to break social media or the internet, for that matter, when you're involved in hockey. Are you surprised at the reaction you get around the game? No, not really, because, you know, hockey's a sport that people really want to know about. And, you know, Snoop Dogg is a perfect guy to teach it to you. So when I get involved, they want to know more about it. 
The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Nice feed from the right wing. Here they are on the attack. Blocker save. Here's a chance right in front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Shot from the wall. Denies him with the save. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. There's the stoppage of play. Let's see what the officials say. Hooking's the call. This is what yeah. they kind of call the lazy penalty these days, yeah, right? It is, but, it, but really, the problem is you're beat, and you panic, and you're trying to help. And the more you help, the worse it gets. Go sit down. And he certainly dug himself a hole there. Another special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. I'm not so sure what they looked at in the penalty killing meeting, but the only thing they've done really well tonight is dig the puck out of the net as this power play gets another chance. They've been so good tonight. Buffalo's got a hold of it against the wall. Toronto's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Gets it out of his own end. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. No, he's trying to dangle there, but he loses the puck. Now he's got to chase it back. Here's a shot. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. Buffalo's got the puck along the wall. Carries it in. Quick feed to Skinner. Slides the puck near the front of the net and makes the save. A chance on goal. Oh! the puck back onto the stick. Oh, a reactionary save! Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. The Sabres gain control of it. Sends a pass over. Look out, a two-on-one. And he comes up with it. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Angles it over to Smith. Drives it to the front of the net. Score! Goal for the Maple Leafs. Let it go, baby. Are you down with the of the wrist and that snapshot beats the goaltender he's in the low slot he doesn't have much time to think about it toronto's got one here in the second they need many more to follow though yeah but they've got to start somewhere i guess something positive something to build on but it's been a pretty rotten game for them so far his fifth of the playoffs. Scored short Moves it around along the half wall. Fires one on goal. Oh, puts it wide. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Solid check to slow him down. Nice dish from the left wing. Rocks him. And that's taken by the defense. To his teammate. Buffalo's got control of it now from their own end. The Leafs gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Intercepts the pass at center. Moves it quickly over to Eichel. Out on the breakaway. Even though they don't get one on the power play here, they still have a comfortable lead. The one thing... Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. We got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. Tripped him up, and he's off to the box for it, Ray. Reaching out for the puck to get your stick into his feet. This is the consequence. The power play unit goes right back to work. Well, you can tell these guys must be bubbling with confidence here, James, because they've already scored on the power play tonight. And so they get another chance. They must feel good they have the formula tonight. Takes the feet at the back end. Trying to get it out of their own end. And no luck with that one. And he says no! Whistle blown as that's redirected into the crowd. Fortunately for them, this save allows the puck to deflect out of play so they can get new guys on the ice. They were totally out of breath towards the end of that shift. Plenty of playing time left in this frame and a solid job tying up his opponent. Fans being treated to an awful lot of lamp lighting tonight. It's 5-2. And that slides right out to center ice. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. And that one's broken up. And manages to clear the zone. 
Snoop, tell me this. When did you start getting into hockey? Man, I used to listen to a man named Chick Hearns. He used to do the uh, games back in the 80s. He man. was a basketball guy, too, right? Yeah, man, but he did the hockey, too, and he was dope. And I used to watch the game and see all the players and fell in love with him. Man, hockey's a fun sport to watch. Was he, was he as entertaining from a hockey standpoint? More, more entertaining. Very, very, really? very entertaining. Marner swooping in on the attack. Buffalo's got the puck now and pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And that one's broken up. Gets it out of his own end. What do you like about the game? Say, man, you know I like the, the goals, I like the hits, and I like the fighting. You like the scrapping element, I love too. the scrapping. Scrap till you get knocked out. Puck still pushing and shoving. The whistle doesn't bring this play to a halt at all. Darlene's not so sure about the weight class here. He says no thanks. Michael's able to get everything behind this hit. He really lays one on here. Sorry, we got cut off there, but do you want to still hang around, watch the rest of this up here? Oh, man, why not? Not why? Ask and you shall receive. He's Let's hanging. get it. Let's go. Eichel's won a big draw on their own end. Toronto's got the puck here in the open ice. Along the half wall with the puck. From the point. Great glove save. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the one, the only Snoop Dogg. Thanks for doing this. Do you want to just hang out, watch the rest of the period up here with us? If you don't mind, I mean, I want to occupy this seat and, you know, watch some more good hockey, man. It's the best seat in hockey. I can assure you we will make room. He is staying, everybody. Let's He's go, y'all. Hey. He looks deep to Wilson, and he passes it up ahead to Wilson. The Leafs can't convert on the power play. Both sides are back to even strength. Immediately, this becomes really frustrating. But as they go back to the bench, the power play will look at that and say, we did a lot of good things. We do that again the next time, we're going to score. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Here's a shot. Dives in front of the shot to block it. And that's a paddling from the goaltender. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Oh, what a dangle! Buffalo's got the puck along the boards. Here they come on the attack. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Let's it go, and he'll likely feel that one in the morning. Buffalo's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Puck picked up in the open ice. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. The Sabres get a hold of the puck in their own end. Oh! No, he didn't. Nice. No, he didn't. Oh, he did. Oh, he didn't. What a hit. Oh, no worries. A split the defense. The Dogfather's loving that one. Man, the split. Good defense. Lickety split. Hello. They've got the defense outnumbered. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Takes a blast, and too much traffic in front blocks that one. Puck picked up by Van Riemsdyk. Feeds the puck over to Yuki Haru. Van Riemsdyk's got it in the offensive zone. Takes control of the puck. On the doorstep, deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And now it's over to Reinhardt. Slides the puck across to push back a Carlson. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Back on a stick now. Here's a short pass to Ruido. And now he tries to get it across to Ruido. Sends it over to Reinhardt. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Can you wake me up uh, at 6 a.m. in Did the that morning? Knock you down up here? Uh, can you wake me up tomorrow? Hey, score! For another one. Toronto. Go. It's so nice out here, man. What a place to be. And a nice goal at that. Hello. Excellent shot. He gets his stick into position to deliver the puck. Goalie thinks he's got most of it covered, which he does, but not enough. It's just inside the post. Toronto 
is answered back here in the late stages of the second. They have to hope this.